first and foremost, my friend, there's got to be a, a funny story and how you can get a nickname like Shoe Face. Oh, this is terrible. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's a, uh, well, uh, a coach of mine, you know, he he's so funny, you know, he likes to put nicknames in everybody and he got a big chin. So I started calling him like a Egypt chin, you know, like the, the big ones. <laughs> and he said, look like your face, man, look like a shoe, you know, and then everybody started calling me shoe face and, you know, I hate it. So the guys didn't stop and here I am, you know, well, <laughs> I'm, I'm shoe glad, face I'm, forever. I'm glad you embrace it because sometimes I notice fighters will try and create their own nicknames and they make it like super over the top and complimentary. I, I think it's actually kind of fun when a nickname like that, that you didn't give it to yourself actually sticks. Yeah, I don't, I, man, I don't think... You can choose your nickname, you know. Everybody I agree. just yeah, just pick some some nickname and give to you. And at least that's how it happened in Brazil, you know. So and they, they they pick the worst ones, you know, so that's why they gave me this one. <laughs> oh man, and, and you've uh, how is your time going so far with PFL? Because I, I noticed that this gives you an opportunity to be very active and fight often. Do you like Being that? Great, yeah, great, uh, great time in my life. You know, it's a fresh start, and I think uh, I can like get a lot of fights. I fought three times this year. Uh, I hope I have two more. You know, and have the same fight. Man. I hope I go to the final and get this belt, this million. Uh, man, I, I love the like the politics, you know, how it works, how, you know, how everything happened, you know, it's just awesome. I, I, I love the PFL and how they work. Yeah, that's wonderful. And, and, you know, tell me a little bit about how you got started. You mentioned, of course, being from Brazil, uh, so jiu-jitsu, like how, how did you get started? And at what point did you decide, I want to be a professional fighter? Man, since I was 15, you know, I started training jiu-jitsu and I said, oh, I, I choose, you know, I find my sport, you know, because I, I was so, so active. I, I, I did a lot of different sports in my life. And when I started training, like martial arts, you know, and I started on, on jiu-jitsu, I said, all right, that's what I want to do for life. You know, when I was just 15. And so I had my career in jiu-jitsu. I became a world champion, Brazilian champion, you know, a lot of things. And after that, I said, "All right, now I wanna, I wanna prove myself on MMA." You know, I got some friends that train. You know, me and Junior Dos Santos, we start training together. Yeah, so, what a guy! Yeah, he's <laughs> awesome. And I was in the in Australia at the time, and he was doing some some things for the, you know, for his fight. And he said, "Man, let's start training Jiu Jitsu. Oh, let's start training MMA. Let's fight MMA." Oh, wow. You know, and. Uh, I said, all right, I, I, I have some, some things to do, some stuff to do here, like seminars and stuff. After that, I'll go back to Brazil, and I'll, we, we're going to start training MMA. And that's what I did, you know, I started training with uh, Coach Doria, some boxing, you know, he initiated me in the boxing. Uh, Coach Uri Carlton, you know, he gave me the blue belt. Oh, yeah, that's awesome, so, congratulations. Yeah, I, knew, I knew, no, no, I, I, I knew him like... For years a long ago, time. yeah. yeah he, I, I was 16 when he gave me the blue belt. Right. After that, I moved to another city and stuff. I got my black belt, became a world champion, you know. But uh, uh, he was an uh, awesome guy. I was always talking to him, you know, you know WhatsApp, whatever. And so I went back to Brazil, you know, started training with him and initiate my my career, you know, my life in MMA. It was, it was a good time. That's wonderful. And, and training here at American Top Team, I'm, I'm astounded just by the amazing talent here. Like, it's so much competition. There are so many great fighters here. Is this the ultimate proving ground? Because if you can get through a training session here, you can win anywhere. Yeah, you could see, right? There's a lot of, like, tough guys, a lot of, like, different kind of trains, train partners, you know, a lot of different styles and stuff. Uh, people from everywhere in the world. So it's awesome, man. I got a, like great coaches, you know, great environment, you know, great training partners. It's everything, everything's just perfect, you know. I can do everything in the, uh, in the same place, you know, my conditioning, my boxing, my Thai, Jiu Jitsu, whatever, you know, like we always train together and trying to support each other. This is, this is perfect. That's wonderful. And of course, you know, the opportunity to, to fight here locally in August. How awesome. nice is that? <laughs> awesome, man. Awesome. My first fight in the U.S. was here. And now I'm going to do the same fight in the same, the same place. And now awesome. it's going to be awesome. It's just my backyard, right? 
I'm gonna get the car. It's like what 20 minutes from my house, so it's it's just perfect. So I can have some some friends over there too. It's gonna be perfect, you know. Has the training camp been good? You feel ready? About I'm a month awesome. away. I'm feeling awesome. Actually, I, I'd like to be a little early though, but good. you know because I, I because in PFL it's a little different. You know, you do the camp, prepare yourself for the season. So yeah. you just now you just maintain. You know, keep doing what you're doing. Try not to overtraining. So you need to balance very well, so you don't get hurt, you know, or anything bad happen. And I, I feeling just ready, you know. If the, the fight uh, was in um, like in two weeks, I, I would be ready, you know. Just, just need to do the right stuff to, to get that hundred percent and get a good performance, good win. Well, wonderful. Thank you so much for taking the Thank time, you my so friend. Much, man.